You might see people wearing orange today or see orange on buildings and landmarks. It's for National Gun Violence Awareness Day, honoring the millions of lives lost to gun violence. And several local groups are also honoring victims of gun violence. Ken's Five's Rani Akor was at today's event on the east side. Those here at Phyllis Wheatley Park are either helping to prevent gun violence or have been impacted by gun violence themselves. They say their goal is to be visible. In a sea of orange, Pastor Rosa Wilson is wearing blue to represent her organization, Stop in the Name of Love. But if we can bring these corners together and these blocks together and we work as one force, maybe we can spare some tears. Maybe we can spare some families heartache. Maybe we can have less funerals. Wilson's mission started in 2021 when a shooting at her church killed a man trying to better his life and injured her six-year-old great-grandchild. But he reached over the back seat to cover the little children. One of the children did take a bullet. Um, one of the children still have a bullet. And in April, a double shooting on the east side took another life close to her. I just buried my great-nephew last month to gun violence. Didn't even have a chance. There is a slight decrease in all violent crimes for the first quarter of 2024, according to the recently released report from the Department of Justice. We want to make sure that um, not only today, but every day, you know what I'm saying, we recognize those who have been impacted by gun violence and they can see the organizations that's coming out that's trying to reduce the gun violence and trying to reduce uh, the impact of gun violence. Betty Price is with the organization Big Mama Safe House, which provides youth programs, therapy, and does outreach to stop gun violence. Investment has to be made with the community organizations um, to reduce their gun violence. The, the investment has to be made because you see when you invest in organizations to reduce the gun violence, it works. Ron Yacor, Ken Spive.